All right, so I've got a question from Carrie, and I'm just going to quickly read out the question about this. Uh, so it says, I thought you'd be able to help me with this. Usually I will try and have a lucid dream. I'll get fidgety, move around a lot. I listen to hypnosis lucid videos and tell myself before I sleep that I can lucid dream, but it never works. Even my sister has dreams. Uh, I assume they mean lucid dreams. And she doesn't want to have dreams. So I find this unfair because I don't want to... Um, I've asked her what she does and she's, she says, I just fall asleep and it happens. So what am I doing wrong? There are two things you're doing wrong here. Nice and easy. The first one is your sister. It sounds like, and correct me if I'm wrong, it sounds like she's a lot younger than you. Now, of course, the younger you are, the easier you will find lucid dreaming. This has been shown before and I've made videos about this. You have naturally better sleep cycles, more predictable sleep cycles, and you're less limited by various belief systems and programming. You've not been told or you've not really figured out that it can be difficult to lucid dream. So you just assume it's easy. It just happens. You know, it just naturally happens. So being young for various reasons, which I don't need to go into here, it makes lucid dreaming 10 times easier. So don't let that put you off. The second thing, and this is really what I would say is the main thing that you're doing wrong, is that you're trying too hard. You're setting yourself up to fail by, by you know, the way, even the way you phrase your question, like you've been doing all this stuff and nothing's worked and you're wondering what you're doing wrong. You're, you're trying too hard. You, you need to relax a bit and maybe even take some time off. Have a complete break from lucid dreaming and tell yourself, I don't care if I lucid dream and really mean it. Take, you know, one, two, even three weeks off where you don't try anything and uh, just see what happens because that way you take away that expectation and that pressure from yourself and with no pressure it's more like it's ironically more likely to happen because you're not you, you won't have that in internal pressure and you won't be worried about it and so you'll relax more which is going to make it more likely that you will lucid dream so i would advise you to completely not give up but just take a massive step back and take away that pressure from yourself. At the same time, watch videos that inspire you, watch you know, interesting like superhero movies, Marvel, Matrix-y type superhero movies, because when you watch that sort of thing, it's more like you're very likely to dream about that sort of thing. And then before you know it, you're lucid dreaming again, and it's all come back to you. But you're putting too much pressure on yourself. And I think a lot of people do this. They, they pick a topic. They say they want to learn something. They try and do it, and then they, within a few days, or sometimes even the first day, they ask them. They ask themselves questions like, "Why has it not happened yet?" Well, it's not happened yet because it's only been a day. Now, I don't know how long you've been trying this for. I don't think you said, but my guess is you've not been trying for very long. And if you have been trying for a long time, then that's also a reason to take a break and to not be so hard on yourself because you've probably been building up this this belief that it's not going to happen this subconscious belief that it's difficult and that you've not done it yet so you must be doing something wrong you need to step away from that and by the way this applies to lucid dreaming this applies to shifting really this applies to anything that you are trying to do that you're having trouble doing just take a step back relax breathe and just try it again when you've had a little break that makes a huge difference believe me so um let me know what you think about that and leave a comment letting me know what you are most struggling with with lucid dreaming because i'm going to start answering questions this applies to shifting as well i'm going to be answering uh, directly answering questions and making videos about them and by the way if you want to learn how to lucid dream i made a huge like free video training for you so i would advise you to watch that if you haven't already i've kind of updated it and improved it since uh, since i first launched it so the link is in the description check it out and i'll see you next time